Hey folks, this is Tico here, and welcome back to RimWorld. So we begin today on a bit of a sad note. We have lost Sky, and I mean that literally. She's probably alive, we just don't know where she is. Uh, she was captured last time during a raid because I didn't notice the notification fast enough. I'm actually not totally sure I could have gotten her back before they got off the map, but... That happened. So, you have to remember though, Sky was a soldier. She knew that this was a possibility, that she could be called upon to give the ultimate sacrifice for the colony, and in exchange, we promised her immortality. If she dies, we're gonna clone her, she's gonna wake up a couple of weeks later with a gap of memory, and just continue on. So this clone will indeed become Sky too. So that means that I actually do want to make, you know, another clone bat and stuff, so that I can keep making, you know, other new colonists. So we're gonna do that. We're actually just going to... Well, that's a marble bed. Um, let's take this bed apart, and I'm gonna go ahead and take out this bedroom so that I've got some room to put in another clone vat and to kind of keep our hospital expanded. So that's part of our plan. Then we've got this idiot, Kimmy. Um, I could indeed just let Kimmy die or something, um, but I, I decided I don't want to. So Kimmy can't get up and walk away because um, she currently has heat stroke. So what I'm going to do is, is I'm actually going to build a little box around her with an AC unit. This is how nice I am these days. Oh, um, I'm going to have to move you a little bit. We're going to build a little box here for Kimmy. With an air conditioner in it, <laughs> and a door, so that you can hopefully stop being heat stroked, I can't think of the right word for that, um, and then continue on your way. So let's go ahead and let's do that, we're gonna need to run some power over. Is this a waste of my time and resources? Yes. But it is kind of funny. So, there's that. Um, the last thing that we need to do, of course, is finish up our rec room, which is kind of unfinished and ugly at the moment. So that's something that's going to happen. Okay, so let's reinstall this bed up here. We actually do have an extra bed now, which is sort of sad, but also kind of funny. So we'll go ahead and we'll do that. Let's make sure first that this gets built. Um, I think we already talked to the orbital factory. Yep, feeding Kimmy. Gosh, you're nice. And we're actually going to need to build a copy of that in here. This needs to also be medical. And we need to make sure that this is going to have a roof over the top. Like so it doesn't really matter. And once that's built, then we will delete this and rescue Kimmy again. And then, like I said, hopefully Kimmy can stand up long enough to walk off the map. Ah, oh, animal starvation. This isn't good. Oh, you guys are set to stay locked in there, aren't you? Yeah. Um, looks like I hadn't set this out right. Oh, a new puppy. Um, I guess I'd forgotten about you. Uh, one second here. There we go. Welcome to the colony, Snaz. Um, I guess I'll train you for obedience. That's okay. We'll get you worked on. So we just need this build now. And of course, everybody's busy doing other things, but it's fine. Sky was not necessarily like a crucial member of the community. So this is not, this is not a big deal. Again, I feel bad saying that, but she kind of wasn't. So, okay, let's get this set up. Perfect. And then we're going to delete this. Um, Kunike, you're going to go ahead and rescue Kimmy. Oh, no, shoot. I have to do that zone thing again. Did I leave that zone up? Um, yes. Let me expand it just a little bit. And then I have to lock QNK into that zone. Um, into zone one. Um, rescue Kimmy. That'll put Kimmy in there. Perfect. And now you can be unrestricted again and do whatever it was you were doing. Were you totally unrestricted? Is that what your thing was? Yeah, I think so. There we go. And now it's nice in there, kind of. Yes, now it's nice in there. Okay. So another thing I was thinking of is I have, you know, my spike squad. It might be nice, though, to have them distributed a little further apart. Like, it might actually be really cool to have them in little, like, sub-bases so that, you know, as soon as they start fleeing, as soon as the baddies start fleeing, I can just release them. I think what I'll do in the meantime, though, is I'll just make little areas around, like, I think I'm gonna put two of the chargers down here. Um, maybe move Wild Rat and Melgaron down there. That might be an okay thing to do. Um, we actually got the material for it. I guess I could just do it right now. Um, we'll just make this out of slate. Um... They're three wide, so I guess we can go ahead and make it... I don't know. Oh, this is sand. I can't... I can't do that. Crap. Well, I can. Well, hold on a second here. I can fit in... None of this is overhead mountain, right? Yeah, okay. Well, in that case, let's just go ahead and let's build a wall kind of here, and then we can excavate a little further. We'll make it kind of like that. And then we'll go from there. All right. So, Kimmy, come on. You can do it. Poison ship. Good, we need mechanoid parts. Good, and it's in a very convenient spot, too. Come on, Kimmy. You can do it. It's late at night. Is this the second person in this colony that I've saved that's totally worthless? Oh, no! You're never gonna make it. You're never gonna make it. Okay, well, let's rescue you. And then maybe lock you in. 
That's not a bad idea. I'm not sure that if I... I'm not sure that if I use the Forbidden Zone, whether or not, um... Or the Forbidden... God damn it, what am I trying to say? If I'm... If I use uh, the Forbidden Door thing, whether or not... Kimmy would still be able to get out? I think we're about to find out. No, Kimmy's locked in. Nope, Kimmy's out. Kimmy, you know what? You're dead. I'm sorry. I, you're you're dead to me. If you would sit still long enough to cure your malnutrition and heat stroke. Oh my God, you might make it. Oh, please get off the map. Oh, thank God. <sighs> okay, let's de uh, deconstruct all this stuff. And where's my drills? So I don't need actually. Wow, there's a lot of this I don't need. Okay, let's just take it apart. All right. Tattered apparel, yeah, I knew that. Research project, I know. We're just, we're doing other things at the moment. We'll get back to it. A caravan request? No. That's not even slightly interesting to me. Okay. So far, so good. You know what else I should do is make a bunch more packaged survival meals. Um, we don't need them at the moment, but we will. That's not what I want. I want... There we go. 90. That's what I was going for. Um, how long do we have to go get that other core? We've got 4.8 days. Okay. Because we're waiting also to get Diddly repaired. Oh, that's right. I was going to build some of these repair modules. Did I install that repair module yet? Or did I just think very hard about it? I did not. Now, let me just double check. I, the repair modules, I don't think, have any downsides. Yep. So, it looks fine. So, let's go ahead and let's get that installed. And then I need one more, and I need to put that on grid. So let's go ahead and let's get one more of those made. Were these anything expensive? Just the mechanoid parts and five advanced chips. How are we doing on advanced chips? 34, so that's okay. Wolf ear. No, I like wolf ear. No. Sorry. This ship, hmm. I'll have to think about how I want to do that. We don't need to deal with it instantly. But it's closer to our base than I'd prefer. Yeah, we can we can probably handle it okay. Alright. Well, carry on for the moment. How's our clone doing? Oh, that's right. Um, let's get this all this stuff done over here. Oh, sorry. I'm having a hard time thinking today. We started a social fight. Are you trying to make me get rid of you? You insulted Wolfier's aunt's courageousness. Oh, that was Kunike. Well, all right. That is very tragic, and you should not have done that. All right, let's get the floor out here. Um, an odds trader. Okay. That's cool. We'll come chat with you. I don't think these take too long to make either. Nah, well, okay, they can do. So the plan is I'm going to move the beds over here and then just put in another um, cloning chamber right away. What do I have for composite? I actually have quite a bit of composite ready. Um, oh, I want to change these bills just a little bit. Um, Plasteel, I want that to be... I want there to be a hundred of it when you start making it again. And the same with the composite. So that way there's two batches running. So that way we can make sure the autoclaves are always full. So go ahead and take this stuff down. Oh no, you're going to collapse that roof on yourself because you're dumb. Yep. Oh well. Whatever. Okay, looking good. Did I not get that? Take that out. And take this out. Oh, there's lights there. That's why it didn't come out right away. Okay, good. That other repair module's done. Let's go ahead and let's get that installed. Still 27 conditions that need repairing. But it is ticking down fairly quickly, so it should be okay. Okay, next up, flooring. Um, Rimmefeller Sterile Tile, because this is cheaper. Let's go ahead and get that put in. Not a lot cheaper, mind you, but it is definitely cheaper. And we gotta get our next clone tank up. And we'll need to make Nutrient Solution. Um, what can we make that out of? How are we doing in insect meat? We still have a lot of insect meat. So, is that what this is set at? Um, insect meat? Yep. Um, go ahead and make like 10. Something like that. And then we'll kind of go from there. It's nice actually having steel, by the way. It's a good feeling. And components and everything. This is great. 
All right, hurry up. Come on, build these floors. I need things moved. And actually, I don't need this vitals monitor anymore because I'm going to be using it over here. I'll leave it there, I guess, just so I don't lose it. But I don't need it. And the other bed goes there. And this will need another light over here. Um, we'll just we'll just use another standing lamp because of reasons. Oh, another fun idea I had, and I don't know if this will actually work. If I ringed our entire base in um napalm and set that on fire, would that keep people from trying to tunnel through our walls? And also, how cool would it be to have a mode of fire, right? I mean, it would set our oil lens on fire, so that would kind of suck. Well, fear, why don't you move your own bed? There. Now go ahead and rest. And now someone needs to go ahead and build another clone vat. Actually, I realized I put that power thing in, but I actually shouldn't have. Let's go ahead and let's take that out. I don't want power running through the hospital. It's dumb. Who would do that? Exactly. And we'll just go ahead and we'll put another one right here. They're not terribly expensive, so I don't mind doing it. Okay, and how's our synthaline going? Not great. Um, I'm going to set that up a little higher. Let's just keep more of it around. I still don't know what I'm going to do with the rest of this space. This is a pretty big space. <laughs> um, let's wait until the clone vat and stuff are made. And then I'll go ahead and I'll floor the rest of this area in. It's not impressive yet. Well, I guess it is. And this count... Oh, this is a barn. Okay. So I'll have to put some doors in here and there in order to make that not a barn. Actually, I could use part of this as the barn. Actually, that's a pretty good idea. Let's do that. Oh, I forgot about the trade caravan. Bye. Whatever. And I wonder if I should replace these walls, too, with composite walls. Well, we can do that in a little bit. Let's get a few other things done first. Oh, Furco, you managed to wall yourself in, because of course you did. Because why not? Can I even build a nice little passageway over here? Kind of. Well, no. Well, sort of. Oh, Furco. Maybe I should research the moisture things, just to get this cleared out a little bit. Moisture pump. Yep. I mean, I can just make this not a bedroom. I just like to have this nice hallway. This will still count as a hallway, but I hate it. I hate doing that. It's just, it's ugly. But, oh well. Okay, so... Yeah, another extra mechanoids around here. Is someone going to build this? What are we missing? Plasteel and advanced components. Okay, Furco is building it. Okay, good. And you are stuck in there now, because of course you are. And why don't you guys go ahead and take these. And let's turn this into home zone. An insulting spree. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. A whole lot of crap is going on right now. An insulting spree and you're hiding in your room. Okay. Well, that happened. How annoying is that? Now I gotta wait for you idiots. We gotta go though, we got four days. How are we doing a nutrient solution? 400 is not enough. So we need just a couple more. Let's make three more. Okay, good, someone is finally making this. Tank is still going good. All right, and now let's go ahead and let's get... Wait, where's Sky's genetic pattern? Huh. Oh, it's being used in here. Ah, uh, okay, so we need another one. Um, who was a Sky clone? You were all Sky clones, weren't you? <laughs> Pyromaniac, yeah. Nope, Steadfast, Fast Learner, and Jogger. Yep, okay, so we need to just sequence one of your guys' genes. Do I have that handy? I do not. Let's go ahead and let's make a genetic sequencer. Um, we can just make it over here. Isn't this where it is? Mm. Nope, right here. Okay. We'll have someone make that right away. That'll be quick. You know what? If Millennium is going to keep complaining about that belt, let's just make you another one. Another medic bag. Um, I guess they're not expensive. Okay, genome sequencer is done. Let's sequence. I think you're the newest. So your DNA is probably in the best condition. Uh, maybe. I guess we'll find out, won't we? Waffle, stop having fun. Come get your DNA sequence. We've got things to do. Come sequence DNA. This is no big deal. Patience, yep. Blah, blah, blah. Okay. Now we can go ahead. And we can use Waffle. Yep. 
And we should have enough stuff? We definitely do. Okay, cool. Okay, getting closer. I can feel it. And it looks like our mechs are all ready. So, we could just go ahead and start out on our caravan here momentarily. In fact, we have to. We only have three days, and it will take us... Well, one day to get there, but still. And it looks like we've got a good number of survival meals, which hopefully no one is eating. Although I can't easily stop them. Oh, another clutch mother. Okay, um, that one I'm not going to worry about. We'll, we'll, we'll deal with that in a second here. we got to get our caravan going. Ah, there's that medic bag. Okay, so before you take it away, we're going to have um, Millennium come put it right on. Force wear it. There we go. Okay, good. It's surprisingly hard to get people to load this. It's like, come on, put stuff in the tank. Is someone actually doing it now? I think I've been forcing Hiroshi to fill it. I don't know why it requires... I don't know. Extra attention. Maybe it's because our VAT person is um, someone who won't carry. So that could be it. I don't know. I know this takes a long time, but I need you to do it. We're getting closer. Like, two more passes here, I think, and you'll have it. There's that one. Three more passes. It's going to be done before you know it. You're going to love it. Wolf ears collapsed. Yep, that's fine. I don't care. There we go. And our clone vat is up and running. And Vort, you're going to go take care of that, right? Looks like somebody else is. Looks like Kunike is going to do it. Okay, perfect. Okay. Millennium, what else are you wearing that's all tattered? Oh, the Mechna controller belts. Really? I didn't know those had quality. Well, too bad. That's what you get. Okay, so let me get this caravan together here. Let me find my list and see what I want to do instead of taking Sky. Well, you know, I can just go easy mode and just take one of the extra Skies. <laughs> um, we can just go ahead and take Fiona. And actually, we need some new guns. I want another um, AMR because I liked that quite a bit. And we'll have Valley go ahead and make that because Valley's... No, Valley's leaving. Who's staying? Um, Waffle is staying. Sparkles is too slow. Actually, what's Sparkles' um, manipulation at? I think Sparkles' manipulation may still be okay. Yeah, your manipulation is okay. So why don't you go ahead and make this? Um, yep, and let's make sure you're assigned correctly so that you will do that first. Sparkles, smithing is number one. Okay, good. Because that was a great gun, and I want another one of those. Okay, so... With that said, is there anything else I really need to do to get ready? I don't think so. I think we can just hit the road. Let me go ahead and let me put this together here. Okay, so this is pretty straightforward. So we're going to be taking um, Neff, Millennium, Wolfier, Kaunike, Cal, Fiona, Furco, and Sushi, Grid and Deadly. Um, along with them, they'll be taking kind of a collection of various meals. It's 0.8 days there and 0.8 days back, so this should be sufficient. Um, some medicine, some beds. And I think that's really all they need. So we're going to go ahead and we're going to head this way. Select one or more waypoints. Yep. Choose route. And accept. And confirm. And go. This shouldn't take very long at all. Hopefully. And then we'll have to keep an eye on the vats. Vord is here. And Vord is set at number one. But Vord sometimes gets confused. Diplomatic marriage. No. Didn't you just ask me that? The answer is still no. Are you serious? You guys got this far, and now you have to go back? Oh my god. Seriously, Cal? Caravan request. Um. God, okay, hold on. Cargo pods. Um. Sure. Great. Cal, hurry up. This is obnoxious. Okay, now they'll continue forming a caravan. Dunalisk. Ah. Uh. Okay. Here. Activate. Um. Activate. Uh. Is there anybody else nearby? 
Just... Come on. The Doodleless Clutch Mother is not going to have a chance to even get anywhere near Cal. Before Cal gets off the map. And then after that... The Scythers should take care of it nicely. Seriously, you guys? And now Kunike is hurt. Okay, so there's the end of that. Oh my god. This is getting ridiculous. Okay, you guys go ahead and deactivate. Thank you. Um, I appreciate the thought, and I wish that it had been possible. Well, that's weird. An exotic pet. Oh, oh, you're Don, right. Alright, please get off there. Okay, here we go. Oh, moisture pumps are done. Okay. Okay, so they'll still get there in 0.6 days. Okay, let's build one of those stupid things. Um, they take forever, but we can at least get it going. Um, this is actually the only place I want one. So we can just put it right here and get it started. Here? I'd actually like to put it here, but then it'll get blown up constantly. Okay. And then it only leaves us with five people, and that's not fantastic. We just need to keep track of the clones, which are going well. Um, actually, we will have Sky 2 before too much longer. Yeah, Brax is never in a good mood these days, but oh well, you get what you get. Anything else you want to do around here right now? No, this is looking good. We've got more potatoes than I know what to do with. Um, it's kind of ridiculous how many potatoes I have. We can go ahead and we can put a light in. What are these under? Those are under furniture, right? These cool wall lights? Yes, we'll put a light in here. There we go. Perfect. That'll make that nice, really nice. That place really nice. Um, I guess I can have you research. We're actually done with everything. Everything that I care about. Um. I mean, why don't you do pulse munitions and then we can get a few more um, of the advanced weapons? Like, we actually don't even need the second research bench. I should just take it apart. All right, since everybody's bored, let's make the barn and stuff that I was talking about that I completely forgot about. Um, that can go over here. I mean, it doesn't need to be a very big area, but we'll make it a little bigger to begin with. Actually, this is the place I should make entirely out of the composite and then not that area down there. Let's do that. Let's make this composite. Ooh, I could even double wall it if I want to to keep the animals super safe. I might, I might do that. So we could make this... A nice little room-ish. Kinda. Something like that. And then also this. And that should keep them super safe. Because that's what? 5 by 2? 10. If we ever have 10 animals, then I'm doing something wrong. We have 7. <laughs> um, but we can do that. And then I'll put a synthamide, or I'll put a, a composite door there as well, and just leave it propped open for their temperature regulation. And then there will be no weak points. Which is perfect. Add an outpost. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Whatever. Oh, here we go. We've arrived. All right, so what do we got? Oh, yeah, okay. So I have to activate these guys. Oh, you're activated. And you're also active. Hmm. Okay, now you I can draft. You I can't draft. So you come with us. Yeah, this is, this is suspicious. Of course. I mean, obviously it's suspicious. And I wish you would come with us, but I can't make you come with us, unfortunately. A barb slinger, I don't care about that. Cows collapse due to exhaustion. Really? Now? This is when you're going to collapse due to exhaustion? Bad news, that's not actually what's going to happen. Okay, we're going to get ambushed any moment now. So that's why I'm trying to like sneak up over here. Sneak, sneak. It's going to be one of these buildings. Probably this one with the door. The suspicious door. Where there will be no problems whatsoever. Grid, man. I need a third core. Just waiting to get everyone over here. Alright. Claim it. Wolf here, if you wouldn't mind going and opening the door. Oh, that's it? Oh. Well, that was easy. <laughs> Alright, everybody come with us. Um, and we'll take the core. And that's all we need. Okay, and just come on back home. Well, that was straightforward. Alright. Oh, look at the sparkles. This is almost done with the rifle. Okay, cool. Oh, um, yeah, I should move all these things in here. Um, there's that thing, and then there's this thing. 
Sure. And then we'll move these zones. Copy settings, delete. Zone, stockpile, uh, right there. Um, paste settings, same here. Copy settings, delete, zone. You know the drill. Um, we'll put it right there, because it's right near the drug lab. Okay, let's do that. Yep. And then go ahead and finish building things, please. Like these walls, which it looks like Waffle is working on. Fantastic. And I think Fiona probably is going to get this gun. More cargo pods. Okay. Oh, good god, that almost blew up in the ship. Whoa, wouldn't that have been exciting? The answer is yes, and not in a good way. Oh, the rifle's done. Okay, good. So where did that end up? Um, that should be up here. That's where they all get put. An excellent quality one. Nice. Um, Waffle, you're here, and you have just a standard gun, so good news. You get an AMR. And you have an eye, too, don't you? No, you don't. I think I put that in somebody else. Well, this is good. They'll be back in a half a day, and as soon as they get back, we can go ahead and pop the ship open. And that'll be no problem at all. It would be nice if you guys would finish building this. That is true. Okay, they built it. So what kind of walls do we want, or what kind of flooring do we want in here? What feels animal friendly? Actually, they're not even going to notice. Let's go ahead and let's give them... Let's give them this nice Versailles wood floor as such. So go ahead and do that, and then let's move all the animal beds inside. Slowly but surely. I don't actually think I have enough, but I can make some more. I'll count them once we're done here. It's too hard for me to count at the moment. Did I miss one? No. Well, apparently I did, because something just took it away. <laughs> All right, all right, all right. People will get to this. Come on, hurry up. Build faster. How are our tanks doing? 12 and 88. Oh, this is really good. We're going to have Sky 2 back before we even know it. Oh, this is going to be great. Oh, they've arrived back. That was quick. And Millennium's in a sad wonder. That was quick. Well, perfect. Um, I'm going to make some more nutrient solution, by the way, because this is only getting made out of insect meat. But actually, I'm going to switch this over to potatoes because I have more potatoes than I know what to do with. Um, so that's what we're going to do. Just do any vegetarian. It's fine. And make like 20. Because I've got 5,000 vegetables. Okay, and did I send anybody that was in a relationship? Uh, no. So they're all coming back to the same places. Perfect. And hopefully someone will finish this then, now that we've gotten, you know, enough labor. Oh, the Dunalisk. I forgot about that. You're hunting Don. Don is way down here. We can solve that. Um... Let's send you guys out, and Valley you can activate as well. I really need these guys to do something cool. Well, there must have been a bunch. You know what, maybe I should leave them active for a little bit. Look at them in their search and destroy mode. Oh, this is going to be funny. Valley, you go ahead and back and just do whatever you want. Let's watch this. Oh, I forgot about this. We should come chop it up. Stupid saving. Don't do that. And that's the end of that. <laughs> Ah, uh, those are going to be a lot of fun. Can someone, like, I have workers. Can you guys come work on this? Seriously. Okay, well, I guess I'm waiting on Synthaline. Okay, but besides that, aren't these supposed to be transferred and stuff? Yes, can you do that? Move the animal bed. And can you make this animal bed? Thank you. And this animal bed, maybe? And I don't know where the last one is. It was supposed to get installed. It's up here somewhere, right? It is. Who's handy? Brax, too late. You happen to be standing still for a moment. Oh, I can't do it, so that means someone else is moving it. Okay. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, and I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, so we need another bed. So we can just go ahead and make what? Camel hide? Sure. Exhaustion, blah blah blah. You'll be fine overnight. Okay, so now we have a proper place for our animals to be just kind of anytime. So now this should be no longer a barn, correct? Why is it still a barn? Is Are there animal sleeping spots in here? Party spot. Animal sleeping spot. Okay. Now are you a barn? Now you're a workshop. Okay, that's getting closer. Um, I forgot I need to move the sculpting table. Um, 
Uh, we can just wedge that in here. Continuing my quest to make this the ugliest base ever, or at least the ugliest workshop ever. This is not even by far the ugliest uh, base I've ever built. Not even slightly. Okay, now are you a dining room? It's very important to me that this becomes a dining room. Yay, it's a dining room. All right. And let's put that back how I had it, because I kept clicking the wrong thing. Okay, so let's finish putting flooring in here. Just because we need to, we're going with dark mosaic, right? And then we'll start building some other cool things. Like, in particular, we need to build, like, a billiards table and stuff like that. And a TV. I'm going to build a TV. Yeah. It's going to be pretty cool, huh? Mostly we're just waiting on synthaline. we got a lot of good art, too, don't we? And I left these three guys active, because they'll come back and they'll charge if they need to. I assume. Is there any more wildlife on the map? Well, there's another Dunalisk somewhere. Oh, it's over here. You know what? Let's not worry about it. Let's leave a, uh, at least one of these guys on all the time. Extreme Break Risk. Ravenously Hungry. Why are you not eating? Consuming Fine Meal. Yeah. Recreation Deprived. Exhausted. Minor Pain. Why? Oh, yeah, because an arm. Well, we can fix that at some point. All right. So anything else we need to do at the moment? 93%. I think we'll wait for the clone here to end the episode. So let's go ahead and do that and hope that's quick. Whoa, 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 whoa. A Dunalisk has become tame. Huh. Can you haul when you're big enough? Yeah. Okay. Sure. That's not even the weirdest thing that's happened this afternoon. Um, welcome, I suppose. Yep. And let's get these set correctly. Bunker. Yep. And base. Yep. And normal. Uh, okay. Oh, can I assign any of these guys around? Oh, Wolfier can get a barb slinger? Oh, that's hilarious. And... Cal? Sure. Sparkles, yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay, good. Oh, that's pretty cool. How about that? Okay, well, we're working on the clone. Um, let's go ahead and let's make a billiards table. Which it looks like I can afford. Can I make it out of plastic? Yes, I can. So, of course we will. Um, actually, how do I want to do this? We can put the TV and some chairs here, or do we want to put the TV and chairs back there? I think I want to put the TV and chairs back there. So I would actually like this around here. So let's move this over just a little bit. As soon as someone does that. Thank you. Um, and then let's add our billiards table. And then let's put in some more lights. We're just going to keep putting wall lights in. Because I think they're fun. Wall light. Um, wall light. Let's try to get the place lit up a little bit, you know. A fabric trader. Okay. And also, I need to start talking to these quest givers. I keep forgetting about them. Oh, and we renamed our new guy. So, welcome, Moken. And may you be exciting and useful. And Alatus is pregnant again. Boy, that gets kind of weird in a hurry when you sort of know who these people are. Anyway, never mind. Back to whatever it was we're doing. Um, I don't care about quality on a lot of this stuff. I leave quality kind of set as by default because um, it defaults to, like, normal or something. And that's, that's good enough. You know, meh. Okay, textiles. You know, this is heresy, but I'm seriously considering selling just all the thrombo fur. Oh, no, I can't. You don't have anywhere near enough money. Um. Yeah, I'm just going to sell some of the stuff. And yeah, I am going to sell some of the thrombo fur. It's good, but it's actually not the best stuff we have available to us. So why don't you have 150? Oh, that's perfect, actually. Okay, cool. Yep, go ahead and do that. And actually, I can start working on the TV as well. Um, flat screen television. Oh, yeah, we even got the stuff for that. Okay. We'll put that here, and then we can put a bunch of chairs in. Oh, this is gonna be nice. This is gonna be real nice. And what am I gonna make chairs out of then? What do I have a lot of leathers? Well, obviously, I still have a lot of camel hide. Oh, and elephant leather. Okay, we can make some of both. Okay, so let me get that set up here. Oh, and our clone is done. Excellent. 
We'll wait for someone to come release you from the vat. Fiona. You know this whole process. Why don't you come release this person from the vat? Welcome. And let me get things set up here super quick. Okay, here's the template. And I'm going to have Vork come and apply it. Apply brain scan template to Sky 2. Yes, this is perfect. And I'll get, you know, everything else set up correctly. First, we need to get that brain scan reinstalled in Sky. Come here, Sky. Come get your new brain. Welcome back. Now, that's got to be a weird one, but here you are. Like I said, exactly what you expected. All right. And so on this fantastic note, let's go ahead and let's take a break. So as always, thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.